I'm getting chills when they tell me you're not yourself Trying to move, but it's hard, I'm out of Nothing belongs to you in life Oh, the picture of you cuts like a knife Whatever they call us, whatever they'll do They're running in circles, circle of fools Whatever we will miss, got nothing to prove But in the dark it's starting to Hi guys, welcome and welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is your girl Mary Smart Kenya. In case you're new here, please subscribe to this channel and don't forget to click on that notification bell so that anytime I post, you're going to be notified. Welcome to a new video, our weekly vlog. And we are kickstarting this video on Saturday uh, by going to Alex School Sports Day. Please remember to like this video, share it widely, leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Both parents and students were divided into groups and they were given different colors as per your group. We had team purple, blue, green, orange, red, and pink. AAR was one of the days as sponsors, so they were providing free medical checkup and also dental checkup. And I was so happy to meet one of you, farm guys. Thank you so much for saying hi and letting me know that you're part of this family. Yeah, I know, I'm over with I think I am I think I I 
I participated in the netball competition. It was parents versus students. I was given the center position, but I wasn't given the rules. The most uh, funny part is that I I was running through the field, but luckily my position allowed me to do that. And tell me why I was penalized because when the we started playing, I I wasn't in the middle part, but I wasn't I wasn't even told. But luckily we won, the parents won, and we had a lot of fun. I see your face, your mouth looks like mine Pretend to dream, surrounded by ghosts in white And oh, 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 oh. I'm in Nairobi and this place is so cold. I thought Nakuru was cold until I came to Nairobi. So here we are. Uh, we are want to do our shopping before we head home. We are done with our shopping and guess what? When you are paying using your Visa card, you are you, you automatically getting a free gift. Initially, I wanted the water bottle because it's color blue. And babe wanted a notebook. But finally, we settled on this uh, thermo, thermo cup. And we really loved it and it was so good quality. Babe usually uses Visa card to pay for his bills. Personally, I use M-Pesa. So please, Safaricom, do something. Also, gift us when we pay using M-Pesa, please. too close 
Finally, we are home and I want to do a quick call of what we got from the supermarket. The first thing that we got, we have onions, red, yellow, and green capsicum, tangerines, uh, tomatoes, carrots, lettuce, cabbage, and we also got some lemons. We got both imported and local lemons, blueberries, beef, uh, chicken breast, chicken legs, all-purpose flour, juices, natural yogurt for making biryani, both chicken biryani and beef biryani. And we also got yola porridge. Babe really loves uh, porridge, so that's why he opted for yola porridge because you can store them for uh, longer. But then, is it possible for someone to cook porridge and store in the fridge? And if yes, how long can it last because i'm thinking of doing it and then i also got bounty chocolate because i wanted we compare with what we made at home i have this video in my channel so i'm going to be leaving the link in the description and i wanted also be able to rate our bounty chocolate our homemade bounty chocolate and this is all that we got Now I want to start to cook and today we are going to be having a beef biryani and I'm going to be cooking a lot uh, because I want to also batch cook for food that is going to be taking babe for like around two weeks. So I batch cook twice for Nairobi home. I know some of you are asking yourself, oh, Kwani babe doesn't cook. Yes, he does. Mostly on weekends he cooks, but during the weekdays, honestly, he's so, 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 so busy looking for money so i usually relieve him that burden of thinking what he's going to eat when he comes back from home because usually very very tired but there is a very very good cook I love, love, love this gadget. It, uh, it comes like a, a package which has a mini food processor, a hand blender, and also has a whisk. And it really comes in handy. I'm done with the first step. Our beef is well boiled and done. So now I want to make our beef biryani. And these are the species that I'm going to be using. Cardamom, cumin. I didn't have uh, cinnamon sticks, but I'm going to be using curry powder as well. And cubes. Babe prefers oilless food. That's why you didn't see me adding any cooking oil. But... Uh, but at the end of the day, we're going to be using some cooking oil indirectly because we deep fried the onions. After the spices are well cooked, I'm going to be adding a natural yogurt. 
and then cook for some time until you can see some like oil separating after that i'm going to be adding some uh peppers onions and then our food will be ready child I know you're hurt and you can't let go it's not your fault and you don't deserve all the bad and the hurt Ooh, I know you tried so hard I know you've done your part It's not fair You did your time How much longer will you suffer in this life? But don't give up Just hold on tight It'll be alright All life you've tried to be a good man inside. Did every uh, this is how our first batch of batch cooking turned out. Uh, I didn't do much. We just have some teaspoons here and uh, the beef biryani stew. On the on the other side, you can see some beef stew that was left over from the first for the from the last batch cooking. So we had it with rice for dinner. That you thought you should. Didn't seem to do you any good Ooh, I know you've tried so hard Ooh, I know you've done your part It's not fair You did your time I have soaked this for like around three minutes. So now I want to rinse and then cut the main reason I soak in vinegar is to remove that chicken smell. I really hate that chicken smell. So that's why I've soaked for like around I think it's between three to five minutes. Uh, this is the following day in the morning and we are straight from church so i want to prepare a breakfast in fact it's a brunch and we're going to be having tortillas and some tea i'm preparing our chicken breast and usually i have some basic spices that I'm, i usually use we have cumin powder cubes black pepper uh turmeric and paprika As for the sauces, I usually use what I have in the house and today I'm going to be using tomato sauce, ketchup and eggless mayonnaise. If you love it a bit spicy, you can add some chili sauce, uh, black pepper or some chili flakes.
for today's tortillas, I'm going to be using the following uh, uh, filling. We have the chicken breast that I prepared, bacon, sausages, and some letters. It's in the afternoon and I want to start cooking because I have a lot that I'm going to be cooking in this afternoon. Uh, so I'm going to be starting with cabbage and for cabbage I usually use, uh, for the spices I only use cubes and turmeric for the color and today I'm going to be adding some carrots. Next, I want to deep fry uh, onions for preparing uh, chicken biryani. For the leftover oil, I usually add some lemon to remove uh, the smell and taste of whatever I had earlier prepared. Today, I'm going to be cooking uh, different types of meals at a go. In short, I'm going to be multitasking. So as the, as the onions are cooking, I'm going to be working on this chapati dough. And in today's menu, I'm going to be preparing chicken biryani, chapati, ugali, cabbage, and boiled rice. Initially, I was supposed to cook uh, uh, biryani rice, but we forgot to buy food color, so that's why I'm boiling just plain rice. Most of the things here are self-explanatory, so I won't be talking uh, much in this video, so please enjoy the music as we cook. Jump into the car on a Friday night I want to drive with you Looking for a bar in the nearest town I've never seen a sky so blue We don't have a plan and the night is young It doesn't matter what we do There ain't nobody like There ain't nobody like You look so beautiful And I'm so lucky to be yours And you're taking me high 
I'm still looking for this fireless cooker. So if you know where I can get this, I'll really appreciate for my Nakoro home. Uh, this was bought at uh, Tusky Supermarket, but it no longer exists. So please, if you know where I can get this fireless cooker, I'll really appreciate it. I'm done air frying my chicken. Personally, when I'm cooking broiler, I usually either air fry or deep fry because I don't like cooking the way it is. I just feel like it has like a certain uh, taste, so I prefer air frying mo most of the time. So now I'm cooking the chicken biryani. I was at the wrong place at the right time. Cause suddenly there you were with those bright blue eyes We were conversing under the night sky When you took my hand said let's leave now Don't wanna be shy I will let my guard down Don't wanna be shy Our chicken biryani, it's ready. And the final uh, ingredient that I added is uh, coriander leaves. And by this time, our ugali, it's well done. In short, I'm done cooking all the meals. And then on this other spot, our rice, it's ready. For today's dinner, we're going to be having chicken, ugali, and cabbage. Yeah, I know. The rice is perfect for rice because it's uh, chicken biryani stew. But we're going to be taking it with ugali. And the food was so yummy. Uh, this is day two of our batch cooking. And I have white rice. This was supposed to be biryani. But we forgot to buy the food color. So we just did white rice. And then we have our cabbage uh, there. And then we have our chicken biryani stew. And on this side we have ugali and chapatis. We went to a small bar with neon lights. Talked about everything that was on our mind. Talking to you gave me butterflies Then you took my hand said let's leave now Don't wanna be shy I will let my guard down Don't wanna be shy I will let my guard down Okay, for these jeans, I didn't label because they're transparent so someone can see whatever it's inside. But for this, I labeled because they'll be frozen instead of opening and then closing. So just know whatever you're picking. So now, guys, we've come to the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for your support. Please remember to like this video, share it widely, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Until next time, bye-bye.